Bluebrow system does need to be installed on level ground. Here we brought in base rock to help level an uneven surface. If you happen to have an existing concrete pathway or deck that's already flat, you're in really good shape. When we size a blue barrel system, there are three things to consider. How much water can you catch from your rooftop surface? How much water are you going to use? And we have tools on our website to help you figure that out. But most often, you may be constrained by how much space you can dedicate to water storage. A blue barrel system requires two feet by two feet for each barrel in the system. Here, we've cleared a two foot by 12 foot pad to accommodate six barrels. Ideally, you're right up against the side of your home. Here we've chosen to offset the system because of a lightning rod and a tree that are up against the house. The foundation for a blue barrel system can be as simple as two cinder blocks under each barrel. I use standard 8x8x16 cinder blocks to create a nice little footing that leaves a lane down the middle of the system for your plumbing. The under plumbing on a blue barrel system is one of its unique features that allows you to drain every gallon of storage capacity and keeps the plumbing protected and out of the way. And barrels are placed at two feet on center. So these two blocks will be under the first barrel. These two blocks will be under the second barrel. And I want to make sure I have 24 inches between one set and the next set. So here I am at exactly 24 inches, and I should get the same measurement here. I want to leave at least six inches in between rows of blocks, but often more, six to eight inches. And then we just work back and forth using a level to make sure we're level and spaced correctly.